Hello there, now that you have set up your Cypherock X1, it is time to learn how to create a new wallet in the Cypherock X1. Before starting, connect your Cypherock X1 wallet to your PC. On the SciSync app, you will see these two options. You get a guided tutorial to follow along as you set up a new wallet. You can create a new wallet even without these guided tutorials independently on the Cypherock X1. We will have a different tutorial for importing your existing wallet from a seed phrase but for this one, select create a new wallet. On the main menu of your X1 vault, select create wallet. Now select generate new wallet. Give a name to your wallet. Cypherock X1 supports up to 15 characters alphanumeric wallet name. Make sure that the wallet name is unique to other wallet names on the device. Since this is the first wallet, it doesn't really matter, but for the other wallets, make sure to have different names. Once you have set up a name for your wallet, you won't be able to change it, so set the name accordingly. Now enter a name for your wallet. Confirm the wallet name. It is time to set up a pin for your wallet. We highly recommend setting up a pin to add an extra layer of security for your wallet. This pin once set cannot be changed. You will have to delete the wallet and create again in order to change the pin. The pin can be alphanumeric and 4 to 8 characters long. Make sure you create a backup of this pin because if you lose this pin, you lose access to your wallet. Enter the pin. Confirm the entered pin and once again remember this pin. If you lose it, you lose access to your crypto assets. We will be launching a service soon by which you will be able to recover your pin but until then, we recommend you to back it up in a safe place. Tap the four X1 cards in sequence one by one below the X1 vault. Card number one. Card number two. Card number three. And card number four. Congratulations, your wallet has been successfully created. In case you lose your X1 vault, as long as you have two X1 cards, you will be able to access your crypto. You would have to buy a new X1 vault separately and use it with the old X1 cards. The wallet creation process requires you to have all the four X1 cards. So in case you need to add another wallet, or if you're using the Cypherock X1 as a seed phrase backup manager, and you wish to import your existing hardware wallet seed phrase like Ledger, Treasure or Metamask etc. Now is the time to do so to avoid the future hassle. After you are done adding all the wallets, you can keep the X1 cards in the RFID protection sleeve we provide in the box. And that's it. You have learned how to create a new wallet on the Cypherock X1. Well done. You still need to add accounts in these wallets in order to be able to send and receive crypto. But that is for the next set of tutorials. For now, congratulations on taking the first step towards self-custody.